Hello, this is Eagle Cam Fan 2 here, also known as JER198888. So I want to talk about something. It's about the future of my channel. And here's a bald eagle right here while we talk about this. All right, let me zoom in here, okay? One bald eagle, probably the, um, the male, most likely. The female always stays at the nest after sunset. There we go. All right, so um, I have some bad news. So I decided to just leave one video up on my channel after I got um, copyright infringement for four videos that I posted that had a one minute clip from somebody else. All right, I don't wanna say who that somebody else is, but I've already emailed this person and I'm gonna just briefly talk about it in this video. So the one video that she has that's longer, it's, she does have a 17 minute video that's basically unedited footage from the beginning to the end. And it was a Big Bear Valley video. And then there was like another video that was like a minute long and another video that was a minute long. And then there was a, a, another video that was from um, Kisachi National Forest that was about a minute long, and that one was edited. Okay, that was the only video that she edited herself, so I'm not sure why she would post copyright infringement if she did the same thing I did in the video. And I'm sure Kelly Condor and whoever those other people are, you know, they, they probably have the same footage on their channels too and they don't get copyright infringement, so why do I get copyright infringement then? What am I doing wrong? Also, I just feel like I'm being attacked because it's just happening all of a sudden. And she just goes from video to video, and these are all old videos. They're from February. What the heck? Like, this is just uncalled for. This is completely ludicrous. And I just, it's just unbelievable that she would do something like this. But I, I already emailed her about it and I basically agreed to her that if she's willing to remove the, the copyright infringement from my account, all four videos, then I will edit the videos on my editing software that I use, which is VSDC Video Editor, that ed editor, and I will shout out her YouTube channel in the video clip. I will actually add the text courtesy of this person in the video. I agree to do that on all four videos. Now, if she prefers, I can remove the clip and then just ha um, have the video pause for a few seconds until the end of the video, and then I'll just split the, the, the ending of her clip, and basically I'll just remove that entire clip altogether out of, out of the two videos when I split them up into two videos. And then I can do the same thing on all the other four videos. So then there, there will be eight videos in total that I'll be editing. And, oh, there's an osprey flying over the bald eagle. Don't worry, don't worry, it's okay. It's all right. Uh-oh. It's all right. This bald eagle lives here. Yeah, let me show you what's going on here. Yep, that's what's going on. Wow, how exciting. Okay, you can't really see the Osprey because it looks like the Osprey decided to go off. Okay, good. So, see, this is footage that I enjoy seeing. I mean, I don't really have to record some live stream of some bald eagle nest to be able to get enjoyment out of videos. I can just record my own. But um, anyways, the, the videos that I posted belong to Big Bear Valley, which is Friends of Big Bear Valley, and Kisachi National Forest. Okay, this lady does not own 
these videos, even though she is a mod that works for the company, that means nothing. All right, she does not own the company. She's not the CEO of the company. No different than, than I, don't, I don't even personally know the CEO of Amazon. I'm just some guy that works for the company, okay? I'm just an employee, okay? I don't work for the board of directors, okay? Likewise for Big Bear Valley. She's just somebody that works for the company. She doesn't know of the ideas that go through the, the company or anything like that. She just um, helps facilitate knowledge to the community and helps, um, you know, bring the, a safe chat to the community. That's pretty much all moderators do. Okay, now I'm not a moderator, but I, I, said, I, I know how moderators are based on the things that go on. Oh man, there's, oh hey, 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 I'm just filming, I'm just filming a bald eagle right here. Oh, What's there. up? Yeah. How's it going? I said they're around here all the time. Okay, that's good. Yeah, I haven't seen them in a while. I, I drive past, I drive through here all the time. Usually what I'll do is I'll, I'll drive up to where that field starts, right near the shooting range. That way I don't have to drive all the way over here to see if they're there. And I'll just zoom in with my camera. And um, today, he, had, he just so happened to be here. That's great. Um, I saw them fly that direction one day, which is very strange because I thought their nest was that way. I guess they must have built the second one. All right, thanks. All right, so anyway, so about my story here. So, yeah, I just don't know what to do. I'll just leave my videos unlisted because I don't know if she's gonna copyright infringe more of my videos. And I'm, I'm going, I went through some of her videos and I can see timestamps on most of them, but some of the videos are zoomed in, so I'm just unclear of what other videos that I have on my channel. So until this issue is resolved, I decided to just make all my videos unlisted so that only my friends can see them. And speaking of which, I only made this channel so that my friends, Bald Eagle Lover, can watch the videos and be able to, um, be able to enjoy the moments that other people may have missed in their edited videos. And the problem is with channels like Callie Condor, um, Lady Hawk, um, Night Eagle 007, etc. Some of the edited footage has snippets of clips that are basically combined together. And sometimes they skip certain scenes that Bald Eagle Lover likes, like beagles, eagles preening their feathers or sniting. That's an eagle sneezing, by the way or rousing the feathers. Some of the some of these things are just important even though they're everyday things that bald eagles do. He still likes to be able to see that as part of the edited edited footage. And what my channel does is it gives him a chance to be able to to watch them again by doing these 24/7 recordings of Big Bear Valley. This takes a lot of computer resources. This person has no idea how much effort it takes to do this. Yes, she says it takes like her two hours or so to edit her videos, but what she does most of the time is she just hits record on her re recording software and then watches the clip as it unfolds on her computer. And then when she knows that the, the event is over, she'll stop the recording. That doesn't take any effort. It just takes eyes to really be able to determine where to stop and start the video, okay? There's no editing involved with 75% of the videos that she posted copyright on, which is the three Big Bear Valley videos that she did. So, 
And also, she doesn't give any credit to the friends of Big Bear Valley. She just says Big Bear Valley, which makes no sense. So if anybody should have violated copy infringement, it's her, not me. Okay, I went above and beyond on my video descriptions. I, I really put in a lot of detail as to what goes on. And I have every right to use these videos in any way that I see fit, as long as I give credit to the organization. Somebody who's just a fan, even if it's a mod of the company, still, still it does not own the, the content. It is the organization that owns the content, okay? And one of her comments um, that Bald Eagle Lover told me that she posted was, they stole my videos. Who's they? There is no they. It is I. I am the only owner of the Eagle Cam Fan 2 channel. And I post these videos for my friends' enjoyment. That is my only purpose of creating that YouTube channel. Not to share videos with everyone else. In fact, I blocked everybody on my channel. I blocked all my all my commenters, all 16, 17 commenters on my channel. They only comment on one video and that's it. So what's the point in even, in even like having them on my channel? I just got rid of all of them. And I even blocked all 100 and something of my subscribers too. Screw them, I don't need them either, okay? I only need Bald Eagle Lover and that's it. That's the only person I want to watch my videos on my channel, okay? I didn't block the person that filed copyright infringement on my videos though. She's okay. But seriously, in all seriousness, um, she needs to understand that I do, I do put a lot of effort because it's a lot of data that goes into my videos. I, I upload 10 terabytes of data every month on my Eagle Cam Fan 2 channel. That is a lot of data, okay? And, it, it, and I have to transfer everything to a USB drive plus my compute, my laptop makes so much noise because um, the it's running 24/7 non-stop, and I have to use an external cooler to keep it cool, and I have to hear that fan while I'm sleeping. So there's there's a lot, and I I have a PC that I do this on, and I have a f iPhone that I also record the videos on, but I don't use the PC and the phone phone 24 seven. There's no way I'd be able to upload that much data 24 seven on a social media platform. There's no way. All right. And all, all I want, all I ask is I just ask of her one thing is just to t please take down the copyright infringement on my channel, please. I'm, I'm really sorry for, for intruding on your content. If you had managed to use the same content as me, but at the same time, Lady Hawk and Night Eagle 007 and all the others still make those same videos too. So I don't know why she's trying to attack me of all people. I just don't get it. And, and why, why videos from like a month ago? Why, why are you, why are you infringing my videos from February? And why didn't you do it when I first uploaded the video, when the video was fresh, when th two or three people were watching the video and nobody's even watching the video right now. The video has like three views, that's it. That's, that's all the video views my videos have. So I, I wouldn't be able to monetize my videos because I don't have enough views for that and I wouldn't try to promote my videos either because I don't want my videos to be monetized. I just wanna make videos just for my friend to watch and that's it, okay? If that's the case, then, then I, I, I'm done. All right, I just want to make videos just for him and that's it, all right? But I will, I, I will make it up, you know, I will make it up to this person somehow by just doing what she wants me to do, whatever, whatever works for her, okay? I will please her in any way, shape or form. You, you just ask me what to do and I promise I'll do it, okay? So I wanna to come to a resolution. I want to come to a conclusion. And I really wanna help her in any way possible to try to bring more viewers to her YouTube channel. So I will do that for her and I will help her. So I will make these videos shine for her so that 
they look their best and that they're exactly the way that she would make them. So I'm going to get going now. The bald eagle left for the night. So until next time, I'll see you later. Take care, everybody.